I, after finishing study, I joined Oxford University as a scientist. Oh wow! Um, so I worked there for five years. Uh -huh. Then various, you know, cancer research, melanoma cancer, Alzheimer disease. Then I thought, okay, let's do the food because food. people always like a food. Yeah. And bring some healthy. Yeah. And uh, nice food. We customize the food. Yeah. All the Italian sauces and yeah. Chinese sauces we we prepare it in our Swindon store. Okay. So we it's all authentic sauce. So from the scratch we do everything. क्या प्लान है गाइस लंच के लिए मेरे पास एक आइडिया है लेट्स गो टू वॉक एन पास्ता दैट्स ऑन कावली रोड ऑक्सफर्ड and uh, they have like a lot of kya bolte hain options for uh, pastas and uh, fried rice and is it noodles. like a proper pasta pasta place um it's a fusion okay. actually okay. like a fusion of uh, different kind of gravies and stuff okay but yeah i mean uh, we'll we'll get to know more okay when we reach walk in pasta let's see so sounds great sounds great for sure okay. Whenever we pass by that place, it smells very nice. Okay, so today we'll try it and let you guys know. Okay. क्या डिसाइड कर रहा है वेजिटेरियन बुक Okay guys time to review 
the food the the food in the house how it is Yours was cheese one, cheese one sauce. Nice. Go for it. Hello, cheese sticks. What did you have? These are the cheese sticks. Cheese sticks. Mozzarella cheese sticks. Yeah, they're they're very good. How is the pesto sauce, pasta? Let's try. Way better than McDonald's. Both crispy, huh? Yeah. What What is yours? Mine is vegetarian option. Mm hmm. And it's really nice. If someone likes noodles, especially Indian ones. Hmm. So here you can easily make that one. What is this one? Best. Your Oreo shake. How's it? Oreo shake is sexy. It's really nice. Yeah. yeah. Kit Kat. Nice. Matcha. Hmm. Nice. nice. Six yeah. Especially that sweet chili sauce, right? It makes it much better. It's cheese and it's fried. What are you and having? I'm, I'm having garlic, pepper, rice. Although, because paneer. of the light. Paneer. Well, it's strange that Warth Bhatt is having veg food. Well, it's Navratri. Nine days of no knowledge, but it's okay. You, you get a face. Just <laughs> <moment here. laughs> Why? <laughs> Why is he having veg? See, I didn't force him. Okay, it's his choice. But after four days, I, I'm forcing him. So don't mm. break in between. Mm. Well, review. Very nice. Very nice. My taste of garlic and pepper. The mess end my head with that paper that is. Love it. Whoa. Oh. Reactions. You know what's tempting me? It's this lemon mm, Sicilian lemon, lemon uh, vegan cake. Right now. What is this? Look at the rainbow thing in there. It's from my cover. Oh. Um, this is the Sicilian lemon vegan cake, whatever it's called. Not going to lie, I had a small bite of it before. One small crumb. Man, the lemon. <laughs> so good. Yeah. Brilliant. Stomachs are full, plates are empty. Yeah. <coughs> and the heart is full and the heart is happy. And the, and the stomach is, is happy. Sleep is coming. Sleep, sleep is also coming. It's but we can't sleep. sleep. We have to. I'm, well, I'm gonna sleep. Well, <laughs> we have. So it's around me. My plan was you would be lucky. Like, this is the calm that next time. Next time. Go home and take a nap and then go to uni. Eh, if, if, I, if I go home take a nap, I'm not getting up before what? 7.30? <laughs> There's no late. point. Okay guys. Walk in pasta. Loved yeah, it. I loved it. Amazing. So I must recommend it please if you guys are in Oxford, Cowley Road. Come to walk in pasta. I'm full. I'm not going to eat it. Yeah. Okay. Peace. Peace out. Bye bye.
Hello sir. Nice, nice to meet you. What, your name? Uh, my name is Prakash, Prakash Guna. Prakash Guna. Yes, so sir. you're the owner of Oak and Pasta. Yes, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. Just wanted to know the story behind Oak and Pasta because... Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, so basically, yeah, we have one store in uh, Swindon. Okay. It's Broccoli, Pizza and Pasta. Okay. And then uh, basically we started with fresh ingredient and uh, customize. We customize the pasta and girls. So nobody's doing customization. So customer can choose their own ingredient, okay. whatever they want, and really cook it. So everything is fresh. Okay. So we run the business in Swindon for last uh, five years, and people like it. So okay. we thought, like, let's open a few more branches. Okay. So we gave them a new name. Yep. Uh, Walk and pasta. So basically, what we are doing here, we we do Italian and Chinese. We okay. combining together. You know, so customer have a feel of noodles, yep. customized stir fried noodles, and the pasta. So pasta is pure Italian authentic pasta. So yep. you know. We do wraps and everything. Yeah. So that's how we, you know, we started here. Yeah. So I heard from uh, one of your employees that you were, were from Oxford University. So can you tell me a bit about that? Okay. Yeah. So in this, you know, I, I came here as a student in okay. 2006 for to study. Oh, okay. So I finished my master in biotechnology in now University of East London. Okay. And after finishing study, I joined Oxford University as a scientist. Oh wow! Um, okay. So I worked there for five years. Uh -huh. Then various, you know, cancer research, melanoma, cancer, Alzheimer disease. Okay. And then I working. I also worked for a couple of years for MRC Medical Research Council again in a town. Okay. And then I work in a cancer company called Immunocore. Okay. Yeah. For immunotherapy. Yeah. And then after I think six, seven years of service, I decided to do my own. Uh, you know, business. Business. Yeah. And uh, I, I look for many businesses, and I thought, okay, let's do the food, food because people always like a food. Yeah. And bring some healthy. Yeah. And uh, nice food. We customize the food. Yeah. Then I come across the broccoli uh -huh. that uh, they are giving the franchisee in the mm -hmm. UK. So I took the franchisee and I took the broccoli name in the UK now. Okay. And now that's how I started the business. Uh, food business. And I also heard that the sauces are your own uh, creation. Yes, yes. All the Italian sauces and yeah. Chinese sauces, we, we prepare it in our Swindon store. Okay. So, we, it's all authentic sauce. So, from the scratch, we do everything. Okay. So, no, you know, all our sauces are made in-house. Made in-house. So, yeah. I can say that you're a foodie, basically. Yes, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. What's your favorite, uh, it's like, favorite cuisine, uh, go-to cuisine? Yeah, well, as a foodie, people, yeah. you know, foodie person love all the food. Yeah, you know? yeah. Uh, basically Indian food. I love Mexican food as well. Ah, same. Yes, yeah. So Chinese, Italian. So now here, you know, in you see nobody doing Chinese and Italian combination together. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know, some people like pasta, some people like noodles. Yeah. yeah. So we 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 are doing both together. It's uh, nice. Anything, any advice you would like to give uh, to young aspiring entrepreneurs or uh, uh, even. Yeah, like any in general, any ad, life advice uh, yeah, that you like to In the UK, there are a lot of opportunities. Mm -hmm. You know, once you finish your master or degree, you know, focus on your study first, yeah. and um, then do work, yeah. research mm -hmm. before you do any entrepreneur or any business. You know, because the business require a lot of uh, work. Yeah. You know, first of all, you need to settle here. Yeah. To get the business. Definitely. You know, yeah. if you don't have proper visa, you don't have settled, then you can't do. Yeah. So first, focus on your study job yeah. and then you can do there are a lot of opportunity here no, no. many places yeah okay thank you so much for your time sir it was uh, a pleasure, pleasure meeting you, pleasure meeting you. and yeah. uh, definitely come to walk in pasta and check it out